Hi. Want to impress listeners thanks to a powerful verbal delivery? If so, make sure you speak in short sentences. Why? Because short sentences are easy for your listeners to follow you. They are easy for you to express. Better still, you cannot get memory blanks in short sentences. For your information, my last seven sentences were under 10 words each. So going forward, make sure you apply the following two techniques. One, speak in 10 word sentences by avoiding link words. And two, state the keywords early in your sentences. I will demonstrate each technique, beginning with the power of short sentences. First, a bad example, followed by a good one. Here's the bad one. It is my pleasure to present to you an attractive business opportunity that will meet the three critical criteria of strategic fit, feasibility, and financial upside. <gasps> That's 26 words in one sentence. Wow! I hope you can remember 26 words in one sentence and express them in one breath. Good luck. <laughs> now, for the good example of using short sentences. I will present to you an attractive business opportunity. It will meet three critical criteria. Specifically, strategic fit, feasibility, and financial upside. Wait, now we have 22 words in three sentences. Plus, you get to breathe three times. Now, this is very important when you experience nervousness. Obviously, short sentences are easier for listeners to consume. Fact is, the less effort they make equals easy listening for them. So how do you shorten sentences? Avoid link words or phrases, specifically, which, that, so, in order to, because. Instead, replace the link words by inserting periods between the phrases, so you can pause. Benefits to you? Breathe, quality control your message, Pace yourself. Next, we look at the second technique for shorter sentences. I love this technique. It is called, state the keywords early in your sentences. The best way to demonstrate this technique is to give you a bad example followed by a good one of keywords early in sentences. For the bad one, it is my pleasure to present to you an attractive business opportunity that will meet the three critical criteria of strategic fit feasibility, and financial upside. Ask yourself, where were the keywords? At the end of the long sentence. Why is this bad? Two reasons. One, the human ear reacts best to the first words of a sentence. And number two, fact is, a presenter's voice volume trails off at the end of sentences due to a loss of oxygen. Now for the good example. Strategic fit, feasibility, and financial upside. Those are the three critical criteria our proposal must meet. Great news, it meets every criteria. We will clearly demonstrate that. End of example. Wasn't that succinct, to the point, and impactful? Isn't that how you want to come across as? Of course you do. So remember to speak in 10 word sentences by avoiding link words. Number two, state the keywords early in your sentences. Now do that, and you too will speak and impress.